I'm Heath Cutrell. I farm in northeastern uh, North Carolina and southeastern Virginia. I farm about 5,000 acres of corn, wheat, and soybeans. So the National Corn Growers Association I've been involved in since 2015. We've won several national wins, I believe six of those, and multiple state wins. Last year we won a national win, highest yield ever of 394 bushels. So. The success to uh, some of my higher yields it has been through my fertilizer company, Nutri, and uh, they have been able to get me involved in ESN. Uh, it's been a great uh, fertility plan. It's been uh, one of my larger components as far as being successful. ESN uh, stands for Environmentally Smart Nitrogen. Uh, ESN is a, a polymer coated urea. Uh, which has a protective barrier around uh, your urea. Basically that allows water to move in and nitrogen to move out over the course of a period of time. That is controlled uh, by temperature, which ultimately dictates how quick or slow it releases. The warmer we are, the greater release. The cooler we are, the slower release. Uh, typically that's going to be about a 40 to 80 day process. Fenton Yule, he's been a, a great person to work side by side with for the last few years. Not only that, he's been a friend and when you put those two together it's hard to uh, to put anybody else against that. Back in 2016, he and I kind of started doing some, uh, looking at some things, and uh, he had been messing with ESN a little bit prior to me coming on board with him, but um, we started really digging in and getting to the nuts and bolts of where ESN is. The conditions today are pretty good. Uh, looks like the land's coming to pieces pretty good, and uh, we started planting corn yesterday, so we're off to the races again this year.